I guess most challenging things truthfully and something that I spend a lot of my day on um, is, is really figuring out how to deliver quality content, but still deliver content, you know, for instance, you know, in a, in a paid post that gives good exposure for the, for the advertiser. Right. So there is a balance there. Um, and I think really what it's about, the first step is making sure that you, and this goes, this goes for people using Instagram as um, a, a revenue source in and of itself as a media company like Think or Prosper maybe. And it also goes for people who are not using Instagram as their main revenue source. Um, but what I was going to say is that you really need to make sure that your content is, is all centered around the same topic and that you stay true to your voice and to that topic um, consistently. Um, so it's really about working with the right advertisers in my case and selecting ones that um, have the same theme and message and really underlying intentions as, as I do. Um, so that, that is a challenge because um, I honestly probably turn away a, a solid 70% of people who, who want to advertise with Finger Prosper, um, which is a really high number. Um, and I, that's just a decision I made early on was that I, I don't want to post content that is an interruption to my followers, to my audience. I want to post content that adds value. And so that, that's the first step I would say is picking the right people to work with and making sure that it's in alignment with your content. So sticking to that, that um, theme that you got going.